Hey Sagittarius, welcome back to Star of the Universe Tarot. We are doing the September 2021 reads. If you don't follow me on Instagram, feel free to. I go live every Sunday for general and um, every other week for love readings. I go live for the new moon and the full moon readings, which are zodiac specific messages. If, um, I just did the blue moon um, readings um, last week. If you guys want to go ahead and check those out. Um, also, um, if you guys are looking to book a personal reading, go ahead and um, check that out over there on IG as well. Okay. Sagittarius. I feel like somebody is trying to keep you off your game. I feel like somebody mm, with the death card here is, is trying to, I'm hearing, end your reputation or your wish fulfillment here, but they're not doing a very good job of it. With the Five of Cups, they regret, I feel like, ever trying to play with you. Somebody may be losing their life here, playing with you, Sagittarius. Yeah, with the Ten of Swords here and the Nine of Swords, I feel like somebody could have, with the Double Nines here, um, Double Nines here, I got Double Confirmation, you could be dealing with the Gemini or an Aquarius. But somebody self-sabotaged themselves into, into a very, very painful ending here. Clarify the death card. Mm, the devil. Yeah, somebody tried to put um, an end to some kind of illegal activity. Or somebody put an end to some kind of addictions here with the Nine of Cups. But they're ready to move forward here. And they're ready to move forward towards their happiness. But there's something in the way with the Five of Cups here. Clarify the Five of Cups. This person doesn't know how to express themselves. They're terribly in love with you, but they don't know how. Right now, you could be, um... <laughs> there's definitely, like, zero communication here with the King of Cups and the Four of Swords. This person's trying to heal, or you're trying to heal, from this person ghosting you. This person could have, um, alcoholic, um, tendencies here with the Nine of Cups, the Devil, and the King of Cups. I feel like this person, I feel like when this person's sober, they could be expressive and very emotionally attached to you. Um, even if they if, even if they're not speaking to you like they're very in tune with their emotions on a day-to-day -day basis knowing that they love you and they care for you it's when this alcohol comes into the mix that this person becomes emotionally expressive in a in a um, I feel like in a non-healthy way this person could um, I feel like one too many, like literally like one drink too many will toss this person out of, just out of sync, completely like, um, oblivious to the world around them. So I feel like that's why, and not just that they, I feel like even right before they get to that point, they become afraid with the Nine of Swords here. I feel like they're embarrassed because they know that they've betrayed you in the past. because on a day-to-day -day basis they know that they love and care for you essentially essentially they feel they feel regret and de and depression and rejection with this five of cups energy that's why they don't want to come towards you even though they're the ones that um initially goes you, or they're the ones that um are not responding i feel like this person misses misses you when you don't speak to them when you don't text them even if they're not replying the ten of swords okay there's somebody that's keeping them in this in this low vibrational state there's somebody here that keeps them betraying you time and time and again Sagittarius um, there's a there's a, um, a messy ass co-worker here that thinks that or, or a sister or a stepmother that thinks that they could run your person's life here. I mean, it could be, um, 
it could be a, a, it doesn't have to be a co-worker it could be a best friend as well but I just feel like this person has to be alpha no matter what this is alpha. she wants to be the alpha female in his life not realizing that this that's not what this person needs nor do they want that nine of swords Yeah, so every time they block you, <laughs> they go straight back into the 8, 9, and 10 of swords. Like, that's so crazy. You could be dealing with the Gemini here. But this person, honestly, I feel is trying to block the hostilities of this, of this, um, of this Queen of Wands character here that could be, um, that they could be directly dealing with. It could be a Leo Sagittarius. It doesn't have to be. Like I said, it's just a very low vibrational female that, that feels like they could control this person's um, dynamic, whether it be their life, whether it be their um, their well-being, their health. They just feel that need. It could be a um, it could be a um, like a stepmother or um, or a karmic mother as well. I'm not really feeling that. I'm really feeling more. So, someone who is attracted to this person Some, this, this person wants this person to themselves they want them caught up and trapped in a bind but with them With the devil card, the death card, and healing away addictions, this person just wants to wants to put an end to this. I feel like this this queen of wands could possibly <clears throat> could possibly be um, an an enabler as well. So, if this person, like I said, has addictions other than alcohol, this person is providing their um, their suffice, whatever it is that that toots their horn, right? Hmm. With telling away addictions and parents that came out here, I feel like um, your, your person could be dealing with a toxic parent or you could be dealing with a toxic parent that's also trying to cause um, a rip in this dynamic. But, or it could be that um, this person has recognized, this person's parents have recognized that this person's trying to heal away addictions and that this person is actually keeping them in this low vibrational state i feel oh okay so sagittarius some of you guys may be dealing um the person that you're dealing with this enabler here is about to get caught up by the parents and i feel like they're gonna um be removed from the picture completely yeah see cancel clear cancel clear and delete this person is um is no longer going to be allowed to be around your person because it's very obvious that this person is causing a lot of anxiety and a lot of trauma and um triggering this per person back into these addictions this person this queen of wands could have acted like such an innocent person in this person's life for a very very long time or actually felt like they did do like this was this was their um This person put themselves in a very, very high pedestal when it came to your person, not realizing that your person, even with them enabling all these addictions, never saw them in that way. Ultimately, I feel like, I feel like this point of wands could have been a, um, a bit obsessive as well. With the four of swords here, I feel like this person um, could have tapped your your person's phone, or could have tried to um, reject your your number, like block it from their phone here with cancel, clear, and delete. And with OCD behavior with the eight of swords here, I feel like this person did it again and again. Like that's why this person would allow them, or they would hang out with them until they got. Um, so fucked up basically so drunk that they weren't taking care of their phone and stuff and that's how they were constantly um 
able to keep um, tabs on who they were talking to and why they were talking to them. And I feel like ultimately to <laughs> sabotage quite a, f quite a few relationships, to be honest, um, I feel like your person has been dealing with this time and time and again with this female, but... But it's coming to an end, like, if this person had the parents supporting them in the past, like, they, they definitely do not anymore. As a matter of fact, I feel like this person thinks that, like, the parents favor them and they're about to figure out real quick that they're not allowed, not only, not um, allowed around them, but not allowed around their son either. I let go of the shadow of the past by seeing someone for the first time with the eyes of love. I think for, for a very long time the parents did think that this person had their son's best interest in mind. And it took a long time but they find, I feel like they finally woken up and realized like no, my son's in danger. Yeah. With the more energy and, and intention I bring to my faith, the more fearless and free I am. You could be dealing with the Libra but somebody somebody's about to um about to break out of spiritual jail i feel like this eight nine and ten of swords is is done with cancel clear delete i find a deeper meaning and, a, and personal growth amid amid the discomfort it may have taken a long time for this person to admit it but they're ready to come forth and come to you and real and um tell you the truth tell you that this person has been in the background really um not as a third party necessarily to them, but definitely as a distraction and definitely as somebody who was um, causing foul play in this relationship for a very long time. Um, I feel like this is going to come out of the blue too. I feel like you haven't heard from this person in months, um, Sagittarius, but I feel like it's coming all together and I think that you've been waiting for this for a long time, so I feel like you should actually hear this person out and see what was going on before you make a decision here. Alright, that's what I have for you, Sagittarius. I hope this helped. Bye.